guys welcome back to my channel it is so flipping hot i have a collective haul for you guys um sorry trying to think a little bit from ross a little bit from tj maxx and walmart i wasn't planning on going to walmart but my sister that just had a baby um she asked for preemie clothes. Um, both of my kids were preemie. Uh, well, Shannon technically wasn't a preemie. Um, she was where she was supposed to be. I mean, she was only two weeks early, but she fit in to preemie clothes. And then Leland, he was a preemie because he was a whole month early. So. Anyways, I was going through all of Shannon's baby clothes and I didn't have a whole lot. So I went to Ross, they didn't have any preemie clothes. I went to TJ Maxx, they didn't have any preemie clothes. And I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna go to Walmart. And I can't show you what I got her. I only got her one pajama because all the rest of them, they didn't have in her size. Um but I gave my sister a bag of what I had from Shannon. And I told her, I was like, try some of the zero to three, even though you think it might be bigger. I was like, it, the material, just everything is different. I was like, some zero to three fit like a preemie and some of them fit like a newborn. So you just have to look at it or a three months. So I bought her one little pajama and then three little onesies and two little pairs of pants to go with it. Before I get into the haul, long story short, I went to Walmart so I could get my sister, well, my niece, some preemie clothes, and I needed to get a couple things anyways. But before I get into the haul, I did get one friend mail package today. My mail didn't get here until six o'clock tonight. Yeah. It's from Frugal J. This is how it came to me, by the way, with it cut right here and right here. I did open it so that way I could save some time. So this is from Jeanette over at Frugal J. I didn't know she was sending me anything. She didn't tell me, which is totally fine. Um, I knew she picked up some things for me, but let's see. I'm trying to see if there's a note. I don't see it. This is what I knew she picked up for me. I have not been able to find the gnome ribbon. So there's this one with all the little gnomies. Oh my gosh. So as you can see, I did take my 4th of July stuff down only in here. Um, my table, my kitchen, everything is still 4th of July. It's just right here that, cause I'm filming and it's really bothering me to have 4th of July stuff up because it's not 4th of July anymore and I want my sunflower stuff back up. So I did this today but like I said, my living room and my kitchen still have the 4th of July stuff. I'm going to do that when I come back from my sisters. Anyways, sorry. But I'm planning on doing a DIY. And I knew, like I said, I knew she was sending me the ribbon. And then there's this one. She took a picture and she sent it to me on Instagram. And she's like, have you found these? Do you want any? And I was like, one of each, girl. One of each. Thank you so much, Mama. You know I'm crafty and I will do something with those. Oh, I've been wanting, is this the, yes, this is the one I've been wanting. I see you haul like 20 of them. And I'm like, girl, I need that in my life. Um, it's Maybelline New York Color Sensational Lip Gloss in Mocha Amazing. I hope it smells like coffee. Because I have a chapstick that smells like coffee and I absolutely love it. It's really pretty. Oh my God, smells amazing. I can't wait to use this girl. Thank you so much. And then, uh, which I can never have enough of this because my hubby always steals a chapstick from me and he loves watermelon as much as I do. This is the Jolly Rancher. And then she got me the Lip Smackers. So, have extras now, awesome. Oh, I haven't found these. I saw someone I saw someone post it on Instagram and I've been looking for them. I haven't gone today and it's been really like, I'm like right there 
like itching to go but I want to hit like as many as I can from here to my sister so I'm not gonna go to the ones here unless those ones are dry and I don't find anything then I'll hit mine when I come back but I saw these on Instagram and I really wanted these because of course the watermelon but those fruits they just look like look at that tomato it's so realistic so pretty thank you so much girl and then there's these which I still haven't yeah I'm slacking I tell you guys diamond paintings take over my life okay I just sit here and I do them I don't do anything else but I saw her haul these and I had a feeling she was talking about my daughter but I know she has other friends that have little girls too but this is the one with the unicorns and the castle so I'll let Shannon help me put these in her room probably gonna wait till um her after her birthday that way we can do her bed and everything will be unicorn and it'll look really pretty so thank you for those she'll love that and then there's this Oh, okay. So she also sent me a picture of this one and she asked, I think this is the one that she sent me a picture of. And she asked if I had this one and I said no, and I would love to have this one. This is the Glitter Vibes by Hard Candy. Glitter Attic, Ice Queen, Too Glamorous, Rise and Shine, Bling Bling, Midnight Magic, Sparkle On. You're like really pretty. Like a diamond, pour some glitter on me. Pour some. Me. sorry but I can't wait to use those and then I I think I saw her haul this and I like immediately wanted it because of course it has the little watermelon it's melon madness pressed pigment palette like does it smell like melon or well I'm not gonna sit here and open that that's gonna take too long but I love those colors you can't really see the other ones because the little melon is blocking it but thank you so much mama love it was not expecting a package but I knew you had picked up the ribbons for me so there's that so now we're gonna get into this haul like I said I went to Ross was looking for preemie clothes because when I had my kids a lot of the time they had it so at Ross and then this morning I used my daughter's step stool. Yeah, not supposed to use it. Sorry about that. My kids are coming inside, I guess, but I'm going to try and keep them outside just so I can finish this. Okay, so I had my mother in law bought me a really, really expensive, really nice breast pump, and I saved it. I never sold it or got rid of it or anything because I wasn't sure if me and my husband were done having kids. So anyways, I let my sister use it slash have it. I told her, I was like, just don't ever give it to anybody. Don't sell it. Like once you're done using it, give it back to me because it was really expensive. So that's the reason why I'm holding on to it. Anyways, it was in the closet in my kid's room. And instead of coming out here to get a chair, I used my daughter's step stool, not thinking, and I cracked it and I broke it because I'm too heavy for it. So I had to buy her a new one and she saw this one with unicorns and she said she wants her bathroom unicorn and I was like well you're not getting a unicorn bathroom because you share with your brother. So like you're lucky he doesn't even use the bathroom right now. So I just let her get this. It's just a step stool. He uses it too to wash his hands. He'll stand on it. Um, it was either this one or one with like that was pink and it had like Paris and the Eiffel Tower. So I just got this one because Leland does like unicorns too and it was only $6.99. So I just won't stand on it because I know it's not meant for my big booty. So I got that at Ross. And then the kids wanted some more like play food. You get 13 pieces, it's just called a fruit basket. It was only $4.99. They have a basket and they fight over it. So now there's another basket and they can each get one. I'm probably gonna have to invest in another shopping cart because Shannon has her Minnie Mouse one and Leland loves pushing it. She's getting a lot, kind of old for it. And so I guess she lets him, but 
They only had one and it was just this blue one, but it has like a bunch of play food in there. So they got that. And then I found these in like the little kids section, but I always use highlighters for um, my word searches that I do. And I just loved the little sayings on the side because it's Ray Dunn. So you get six gel highlighters. It was only $2.99 and it comes in this like little iridescent case. This one says for, for something awesome. This one says for inspiration. The most important. And I really like the colors too. Only a little important. That's cute. for happy thoughts and remember for later. So I wonder if it's, oh, okay. Oh, that's weird. That's weird. It is gel. Okay, I'll have to try those on my word searches, but it's the color of the tube, not the cap. So this one's orange, this one's green. You get blue, purple, pink, and yellow. So I thought that was a really good deal. And like I said, I use highlighters for my word searches and I like to mix it up. You know, a couple pages I'll use one color and then a couple, another couple pages I'll use another color. I'm just weird like that. And then I have a really nice um, napkin holder. It was given to us when we first got our apartment. I mean, it's nice, but I really don't like it because it wasn't like mine that I got to pick out. So I haven't been able to find one that I like. And I found this one and it says wipe. I love that it's just white. The other one, it has a little hole right here. So the napkins tend to slide and fall. That's why I don't like it with the smaller napkins. And I like that this one will just stand straight and it's not gonna fall through. This was $4.99 and it's by Joseph A collection. I just really like that it said wipe on there. I mean, I can always take polish remover and wipe that off and I can always just write like home or napkins if I decide to change it, but it does have the little grippies so it won't slide around on your counter. So that's all I got from Ross. And then I went to TJ Maxx to look for preemie clothes. They didn't have any, but I found these. And of course it's not, I don't have my summer stuff up. I mean, I could still put it back up, but I'm, no, I'm gonna keep my sunflower stuff. But these are just so cute and I'll use these even when it's not summer. Um, they're, they were $3.99 and you get a big one and a little one. And I love that this one has the seeds and then this one's white with the watermelons. The lady at the register even said that these were cute. So I got those. And the last thing from TJ Maxx, I got myself a pair of pajamas because I just, I usually wear a big t-shirt and like pajama pants, but it's been so hot lately that I just, I need something else. So they're like Capri. They're really, really soft and flowy. And I love the like cheetah zebra print. They have pockets, which I love. And it was $14.99 for the tank top and the pants or the capris. So, I mean, that's, that's not bad. And like I said, they're really, really soft. I can't wait to wear these tonight after I take a shower. Can't wait to take a shower because it's so hot. My hair is like all over the place. So that's it from TJ Maxx. Now I'm gonna show you Walmart. There isn't a whole lot. The kids did each get a new water bottle, but they're, they already have them. They're just stainless steel and they have a little straw and then it has a little handle. They were like $5 each. Shannon got one that's pink with flowers and a unicorn and Leland got a blue one with fish on it. Um, which they need new ones because the ones that I bought when I went home, yeah, you can't even see the design on them anymore because I've washed them so many times. Um, boring, real quick, needed another flu fruit fly trap. I made ceviche yesterday and there was a ton of fruit flies in my kitchen. So I love using these, they work great. You get two in there, so I got another one of those since I was there. And I got this huge thing of 100 paper plates. These are the perfect size for my kids for lunch. Um, 
they're just by great value it was like three something for a hundred and then I also got my shout since I was there so that way I don't have to go next week or whatever I have some but like I said I was there I was like I'm just gonna grab it while I'm here so I went ahead and got shout and needed a new razor haven't tried this one before this one is the Gillette Venus Comfort Glide Plus Olay. Um, five blades, one razor, and two cartridges. So I got that. For me, it's just cheaper to buy a whole new razor than buy the refill blades because those are like 20 bucks. This was like $12. So yeah, that's why I'm always buying a new razor. It's not, and I keep the little thingy like the wand. I have like a drawer full of razor wands, but I don't ever buy the refills. I just keep them just in case if I ever do. Anyways, I got some K cups. I'm not out, but like I said, I went to Walmart. I was there, so I got it. The kids wanted some fruit snacks. So the box of the princess ones that I got from the 99 cent store, I'm gonna send that one with my kids to my in-laws. And then this one they can open now. It's just the value pack. You get 20 in here. And it does have all these characters in there. So they just got the Pixar one. And then when I was looking at the razors, Shannon found these. These were only like $1.47. Hers is grape scented. And it's Dino Fizz. Bath Fizz. Surprise inside. Collect all three. So she got purple. And he got melon, which is green. Oh my god, it smells so good. Also, bath fizz, surprise inside. So they each can do one of those when they take a bath. Shannon needs more shorts, so I just got her... Where's the other pair? I just got her two of the same. She loves these. So I just got her the black. And they were only two uh, two eighty eight, not two ninety eight. But I got her two of those. I needed another pair of leggings because this is like all I live in. I don't wear my jeans because it's just too hot. And it was $4.44, so I just got another pair of those. Another black uh, tank top. And then I found this shirt and it's really cute. I hope I didn't, I just realized that I got a size bigger than I usually get. So I'm hoping it's not too big on me and it looks okay. Um, because I want to wear this tomorrow when we go see, or on, I keep thinking today's Friday, when I go see my sister. I just love the pink color with the stripes. I'm guessing it's going to be fine, but they had a ton of different colors. It was $4.98, so five bucks for a shirt, that's not bad. I don't have any of this color, so I really like it, and I just thought that would look really cute with some leggings and some flip-flops. So, that's all I got from Walmart. So like I said, it wasn't a very big haul, but I did want to show you guys what I got and I just figured I would do it all in a collective haul. I don't know if I'm going anywhere tomorrow before we leave. Um, I'm going to be packing and like doing a lot of laundry. Um, so if I do have to go out to get a couple more snack food items or anything like that, then I'll do another haul. Um, I do have one bag from Dollar Tree, but there's really not a whole lot in it. So I just I'll just throw that in with when I come back from my sister and do a Dollar Tree haul so thank you again so much Jay love everything you're so sweet I can't wait to use that ribbon I'm already trying to think of some DIYs to do um hope you guys enjoyed if you did give it a big thumbs up make sure to like comment subscribe I would love to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already and until then I'll see you guys next time bye